Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fun. Our lesson for today is all about solving routine and non-routine problems involving experimental probability. This is our problem. Shella writes the letters of the word below in pieces of paper and put them in a box. She then picks one letter at a time. What are the possible outcomes? Find the probability of drawing M, a vowel, and a consonant. How we are going to solve the problem? Yes, you are right. We're going to use the four-step plan. First is we're going to understand the problem. We should know what is asked. So, what is asked in the problem? Alright. It is asking for the number of possible outcomes of picking one letter at a time from the word mathematics. Another question. The probability of drawing M. Next, the probability of drawing a vowel. And lastly, the probability of drawing a consonant. We should know also what are the given facts. Given the letters of the word mathematics to put in the box. The next step is we're going to make a plan. What strategy can we use to solve the problem? So in this problem, we can do an experiment of drawing a letter from the box. The next step is we're going to carry out the plan. Let's solve the problem. So for the first question, since the word mathematics has 11 letters, then there are a total of 11 possible outcomes. So our answer is 11 possible outcomes. For the second question, there are two favorable outcomes when drawing M. We have two letter M in the word mathematics. So... The formula in finding the probability of drawing M is P is equal to favorable outcomes over total possible outcomes. So the favorable outcomes is 2 and the total possible outcomes is 11. Therefore, the probability of drawing M is 2 over 11. For the third question, there are four favorable outcomes when drawing a vowels. We have four vowels in the word mathematics. A, E, A, and I. So, this is our formula in finding the probability. P is equal to favorable outcomes over total possible outcomes. So, for our favorable outcomes, it is four and the total possible outcomes is 11. Therefore, the probability of drawing a vowel is 4 over 11. And for the last question, this is our answer. There are 7 favorable outcomes when drawing a consonant. The consonant letters in the word mathematics are M, T, H, M, T, CS. So we have seven favorable outcomes. Then we're going to use this formula. P is equal to favorable outcomes over total possible outcomes to find the probability. So the favorable outcomes is seven and the total possible outcomes is 11. Therefore, the probability of drawing a consonant is 7 over 11. Okay, we already solved the problem. And the last step is we're going to check. So, 
by conducting the experiment of drawing a letter from a box, we can check if our answers are correct. This is our second problem. You put 10 names in a spinning wheel, including your own. One name will be drawn for a prize. What is the probability that your name will be drawn if your name is in the spinning wheel only once? To answer this problem, we're going to play in a spinning wheel. Watch and observe how it works. Did you enjoy watching the spinning wheel? So, let's answer now the problem. And this is our solution. In the spin name game, there are 10 names listed in the spinner. Each name appears once. So, the favorable outcome of each name is 1. What is the formula to find the probability? Yes, you are right. P is equal to favorable outcome over total possible outcomes. So, our favorable outcome is 1 and the total possible outcomes is 10. Therefore, the probability of drawing your name in the spinning wheel is 1 tenth. I hope that you understand our lesson for today and thank you for watching.